Hi everyone, I'm Alain Provo. Welcome to Tips and Tricks from Solid Experts. Uh, today I'm here to uh, uh, give a little reminder of uh, some options that inside our tools sometimes may be uh, forgotten, unchecked, or maybe because we just upgraded our SolidWorks, those options are not checked by default. So, um, my pleasure to uh, meet you guys today and uh, let's Dig in SolidWorks to see what happens in Wellmint. So I'm going to open up a model that we did see in the past because I use most often the um, models from our launches so that they uh, are uh, sometimes uh, well-known uh, uh, examples and doing this makes it a lot easier also for me to, uh, to show you guys. So I have an assembly here and uh, I have a Wellmint assembly also in there. And all I want to do is uh, maybe uh, open up my model and see um, the option I want to talk to you guys about. So uh, we know with Wellmints we can uh, do uh, uh, Wellmints with 3D sketch. We're more with more than one sketch. It can be 3D or 2D sketches combined also no matter how you want to create your concept, uh, Wellman is very flexible and you'll be able to do it. As you can see, I have different profiles in my model. And, and, and this happens a lot in, in Wellman assemblies. And sometimes we have a little hard time to maybe adjust those profiles together. And, and this is because sometimes we missed a little option inside Wellmint. So let me dig into my toolbar of Wellmints and go into the adjustments. So the famous trim and extend feature. And, and then I'll pin this one up because I want to be able to create uh, with only one function all my, uh, my trims. So I want to adjust those two profiles. I have a rectangular one and a square one. And, and sometimes this option is the one that is checked by default. So you see it's a little, a little grayed out. But what happens is when I choose my profiles, the, the trim is not perfect. I want to do a meter trim on these or a, a 45 degree angle trim, but really it's not perfect. It's, it's really not what I want. But if I go to the adjust between different profiles, then you see that the cut will be perfectly positioned on the different profiles. So I can accept this uh, trim and go on with my other models. Quickly like this, I'll be able to create all my trim inside the same tool and that's it. So basically what I, I aimed to do was to change the, the way my concept was organized and it was just because of one little unchecked box uh, or option inside my Wellman tools that did not give me the perfect uh, look that I needed for my conception. So I hope this trick helps you out in Wellmans and hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.